Hello friends, welcome. It's day seven of Pillow Books. Can you believe that? Wow, a week already, but it's all good. I'm Aunt Leslie and tonight I'm going to show you a favorite pillow that I've made and also read you a bedtime story and then we'll have show and tell at the end. And maybe my silly dog Barbara will run across. Can you hear her squeaks? She's squeaking her squeak toys now. She loves playing with those very much. So that's what you hear in the background. So the pillow, I'm super excited about this. My friend Judy sent me this tea towel that says that's how I roll because I love to bake and make pies. And I made it into a fun little pillow and I folded it over so it's the same tea towel on the back and it has this super fun fringe that has blues and oranges in it and it matches oh no barbie that's not a toy <laughs> she tried to take it she's trying to take that pillow that's silly ah yeah so the the fringe color kind of matches the brick wall doesn't it yeah that's why i made this one it makes me very happy thank you judy so tonight's book is one that i enjoyed reading my daughter very much it's called rainbow rob i love rainbows in all sorts of colors this will be good you ready? Okay, here we go. And still with the squeaking in the background, but it's okay. Here we go. Rob is black and Rob is white. No color at all, just dark and light. But Rob does not like black and white. He'd like to be a brighter sight. Then one day, Rob looked up at a rainbow sky. He looked up and wondered why. If there's red and pink and blue, could he be rainbow colored too? Wow, I wonder what it would be like to be different. Could he be red like a fox? A red fox giving chicken shocks? But Rob is not red and cunning. He's black and white and bad at running. Why don't you try orange, Fox says. Could he be an orange orangutan? An orange orangutan in a jungle gang? But Rob could not live in a tree. He's black and white and would miss the sea. Why don't you try yellow? Could he be yellow like a lion? A yellow lion as strong as iron? But Rob is not a yellow cat. He's black and white and that is that. Why don't you try green? Could he be a green crocodile? A crocodile with a snappy smile? But penguins are not crocodiles. They're black and white and walk for miles. Why don't you try blue? Could he be blue like a whale? A big blue whale with a tail? But Rob could not be big and blue. He's black and white and quite small too. Why don't you try purple? Could he be a purple butterfly? A butterfly up in the sky? But Rob could not be fly to and fro. He's black and white and walks on snow. Why don't you try pink? Could he a pink, be a pink flamingo? A pink flamingo from San Domingo? But Rob could not be pink and uh, be a pink bird. He's black and white. Have you not heard? Rainbow Rob could not decide which color he liked. Of these he tried. What's wrong with being black and white? We think black and white's all right. Zebra, badger, panda too. We're black and white just like you. Look at all the black and white animals. Come on. Yay! Oh, Rob will stay black and white. Yay! I hope you liked Rainbow Rob. I enjoyed that one too. Okay, for show and tell tonight, I have a picture for you. It is a picture that I found a while ago. And this is me when I was about a year old. And that's my mama. Her name's Mary. She was an excellent mama. Yes. I hope you enjoyed the story and the pillow. And I can't wait to see you again tomorrow night. So hello to Kira. Hi, Bog. Hi, Leo. Hi, Matilda. Hello, everyone. So join me tomorrow night and remember, be good because your parents need it. Give. When in doubt, give more.